It sometimes happens in experimentation that one tries to obtain one thing and obtains another instead. This is a story that begins at the end of 2012 in the wake of the statements of Andrea Rossi, the Italian who between 2010 and 2012, he publicized his experiments on cold fusion. At that time I had built a small reactor to be used in LENR reactions for the study of hydrogen absorptions in nickel powders and other alloys. The intention was to make a synthesis of magnesium nickel hydride. This hydride can be used in hydrogen storage systems as a valid alternative to high-pressure steel cylinders where limited weight and a small footprint are required. My interest in this hydride was limited to its possible use in the LENR field in nickel hydrogen systems. On the screen, the appearance of magnesium nickel hydride, I had found an excellent and detailed procedure that allowed us to obtain in a single step in a controlled environment, first the magnesium nickel alloy and then the magnesium nickel hydride, all with hydrogen at a pressure of 10 bar and a temperature of 600 degrees Celsius. Magnesium powders of 100 micrometers and nickel powders of 2 to 7 micrometers are used in a molar ratio of 2 to 1. On the screen, the thermogram of the synthesis. The small reactor I used for medium-high temperature LENR experiments, mainly on Ni powders, was fine for this synthesis. This is the reactor and you can follow the procedure directly on the screen.
On the screen the list of reagents necessary for this synthesis. If you found this video interesting, don't forget to leave your like. Thank you for your attention. To the next.